Welcome. My name is Loes van der Heijden and I want to give you a sneak preview of our new digitizing software for long arm quilters, Art and Stitch. In this movie I will show you one of the functions, how to use creative fillers in a shape. Here's the program. On the left here, these are the drawing tools. For this video I will not draw the shapes and fillers myself, but use custom shapes included in the software. In this example I will use a design made for us by Claudia Pfeil, a very talented free motion artist. It's her special fun feather style that I'm going to use as a filler here. Here it is. This will be used to fill a shape. Now I can draw any shape I want using the drawing tools, but for this video I will just use a custom shape again. There are several types of shapes included, even more than you can see here. Let's take this heart. Now I'm going to resize the shape and move it over the background filler to find the best fit. Mm, let me take another color so that I can see it better. And just move it. Uh, this should do it. All I have to do now is select the background filler and the shape both together and click on the Apply Creative Fill button. Okay, press the space bar. Here the artwork is done. On to the stitch part. Just click on the Run Stitch button to apply a running stitch. Design is ready. Let me show you how it will sew. Without any jumps, just one start, one stop. How to tweak and edit the design by selecting a moving point is shown in a different movie. Now just save it. You can save the designs made in Art & Stitch in all major long arm quilt formats. The list is even longer, so let me move this up so that you can see the entire list here. Here you go. Compute Quilter, Handy Quilter, PC Quilter, well, you name it, it's there. And it's also available, or you can also save, in all major home embroidery machine formats. And this is just one of the many functions in our new software. For more information, please visit our website. Thank you for watching.